let's have a little fun with a mailbox and take a look at a couple of interesting effects. Here we have a mailbox. If you bounce into it, bump it, makes a uh, clang sound. And here's another interesting thing. We can jump on top of it. Here we're on top of it. Now we step off. We're off the box, the mailbox. Let's take a, take a look at how this can be created, and it'll illustrate a couple of issues that you need to know about. First, we'll go into the editor, and we'll remove the previous items. I'm setting the grid to 32 units. Let's start by making our mailbox. I'm on the object tab. So I just click and place an object. I want this object to be angle 0. So we'll edit the angle to be 0. And we're going to make the texture mailbox B for blue. And let's take a look at that. Here we have our mailbox. You'll notice that I'm able to push it around. And in fact, I can push it right through the walls. So let's fix that. We'll give it a mass of 9,000. Save, load, edit. Okay, now our mailbox sits still quite nicely. But it's not making the clang sound. So let's go into the editor. And we're going to convert this into an O tag SW. That's an object tag switch. We're going to give it a tag of 100. That tag of 100 is going to activate an O sound by giving the O sound a tag of 100 as well. And in the auxiliary, we're going to use clang 2. If you don't happen to know the sound that you want to use, you can press Alt-N and then click on Wave if it's not already selected. And this lets you click on different, click on different waves to see what they sound like. I know I want to use clang 2, so we're good to go. Now let's double check. We've got our tags in there. We have the auxiliary set to clang 2 in the sound 1. We should be good to go. Interesting, but we seem to be going through it. What's happening with that? Okay, I guess we're just marching around it. Um, let's not worry about that at the moment because that will be solved by addressing the next issue, which is we cannot jump on top of this box. The mailbox, we can bump into it, but we can't jump on top of it. In order to make a mailbox that we can jump on top of, there's a very simple solution. In the editor, we go to our domains, and we'll click Add to add a new domain. We'll make this our box. We want no ceiling texture, no floor texture. We'll leave the floor at uh, 48. And let's make the ceiling height of 52 units. We'll go back to our walls and we have to set the front of this wall to 1 which is our new, brown, uh, new R box 
and let's zoom in a little bit. And we will surround this mailbox with a uh, walls to make this our box that we can stand on top of. Now there's a problem here, and I'll show you what the problem is when we save and load. Okay, we forgot to take the texture out. It's kind of nice. It gives us a uh, little view of how tall our box is. So let's, first of all, put no name in these side walls so that they're invisible. And we'll go to our domain one and let's make this 64 units. Save, load, and edit. Well, there we have a box we can jump on which is what we were looking for and we did that with an R box that surrounds it however at this point it doesn't clang when we bump it that has a simple solution if you look at the object you'll notice that the object is pretty much surrounded by this R box so we're bumping the R box and we're not bumping the object until we jump on top and then we bump the top of the object. So all we need to do is increase the radius. We'll increase it to something like 40. Now the object pokes out around the R box. So now when we bump it, we bump the object, not the box, and we're getting our clang sound. And we can jump on top. So we could use this to create like a little stair step to get up onto a special area in a game. Good, so let's review. In the editor, we have our player object. We have an OTAG SW with a mailbox B right there as the texture. So that's the mailbox model. That's an OTAG with the tag of 100 that is hooked to an O sound that also has a tag of 100. That's how they're hooked together. And then we have a nice R box that surrounds this whole thing. Alright, so go forth and do likewise.